This video is going to show a tattoo burglar that does a good job hiding his face, but not a good job hiding his tats. Take a good look here. If anybody recognizes these tattoos, going to drop his little hammer here. Oh, that wasn't planned. So he gets the cash drawer. Now again, take a good look at those tattoos. I'm going to highlight them throughout this video. I would say he's got pretty pretty tall. He's not a short guy. He extends almost that whole room uh, halfway in, inside. So he's got to be a taller person. The other thing I wanted to point out was this bottle. I'm not sure if they recovered that outside or anything. Looks like some sort of Gatorade bottle. Um, but anyway, so he's going to take the cash drawer and then decide he's going to come back. Um, the video picked up here. He's going to open the door. This time he covers his head um, with uh, some sort of shirt. Not sure what these are, the black kung fu's. So he's going to, you know, take a look around. I don't think he can see much at all likely really dark here's the new york shirt maybe a sports team he's gonna pull out a lighter here because he can't see nothing and again I, I don't think i don't think he planned on coming in here initially um this is somebody that's been doing this all the time apparently um this time he you know showed his tattoos um uh, apparently he's been known to uh do this in other businesses, the same description, um, same MO in the same area. So it looks like you got some cash there. Maybe shining his lighter. Got some cash. You know, the adrenaline that's pumping through this guy right now. Uh, you know, he constantly is checking over his shoulder, waiting for the, you know, police to uh, be right there for him. Something crazy. So he just continues to sift through, look around, touch everything. You know, just go through these people's stuff like they don't work hard and, you know, sacrifice uh, probably everything to run their business. I'll just come in overnight and just take whatever I want. So he's lucky he didn't, you know, light something on fire. All that paper and curtains. So... Take a good look at these tattoos. Again, watch this video as many times as you need to. Uh, see if we can get this person identified. Um, the tattoos are very uh, distinct and uh, unique. Uh, somebody's got to know who this is. And again, he's constantly hitting the same businesses in the area, taking whatever he wants and uh, getting away with it. So we got a good video here. Um, let's, you know, get a lot of eyes on this and see if we can identify those tattoos and find out who this person is. It gets a little Amazon package. You're going to stuff their cash in his pocket here. Again, if you recognize this person, let's put a stop to this little crime spree. Take a good look at those tattoos. I'm going to show a few pictures here. Um, you know, give the uh, New Haven Police Department a call, ASAP, uh, so we can put a stop to this. Uh, shoot us a message. Shoot us a tip, 860-933-0580, uh, so these people don't have to deal with this anymore. All right?